Hello, this is Joe Wiles with the Rock and Roll Conservatory, and this is Today in Rock History. Today is June 27th, and on this day in 2002, on the eve of a new American tour, The Who's bass player, John Entwistle, died of a heart attack. He was 57 years old and died in a Las Vegas hotel room. If that's not rock and roll, I don't know what is. In honor of the life and death of John Entwistle, we're going to learn The Who's I Can See for Miles. The song starts off with an open E power chord. That's your open E string, 2nd fret A, 2nd fret D. We're going to hit that once and then just hit our low E string. It sounds like this. Then we're going to hit an, a full open E major chord. Open E, 2nd fret A, 2nd fret D, 1st fret G, open B, open high E. Okay. We're going to continue with the low E string. Then we're going to get a hit a G5 chord. That's our middle finger on the third fret of the low E string. That same finger is muting out the A string so we don't hear it ring out. Then open D, open G, third fret B and the high E. So you don't hear that A string. Then you're going to play an A5 chord, which is an open A, second fret D, second fret G, fifth fret high E, excuse me, high B and high E. Okay? Those chords in, uh, in sequence sound like this. Join us tomorrow and we'll honor the life and death of two roadies that laid down their life for rock and roll. I'll see you then.